We're going to share five clothing essentials by Unbound Merino to pack for your Japan trip. And we'll be giving away a $250 gift card to Unbound Merino. Thank you to Unbound for partnering with us for this video. Men's Compact Travel Hoodie. This is my favorite piece of clothing that I own by Unbound. In fact, this is the most comfortable and this is the best travel hoodie I have ever owned. It is super comfortable and very durable and I wear it almost every single day in the fall time and especially in the winter time. So in the fall time, if it gets a little bit warm, then I can take it up, roll it up because it compacts down very small and I can just stick it in my backpack. Also, it's really good on the airplane. I always take it on the airplane because sometimes you can get really cold, especially on an international flight. I put this on and that's perfectly sufficient. And because it stays so fresh, I wear this every single day, especially in the winter time as a layer underneath my coat. And in fact, I only had this washed one time this past winter in Hokkaido, and that was only because playing with the kids, I got some mud on it. The one tiny issue that I have with it is there is a little bit of pilling on the back, and that happens because I wear a backpack a lot. However, it's minor, and it's something that is gonna work itself out eventually, and I'm sure it'll all be gone. So again, I love this hoodie. It's a fantastic hoodie, highly recommended. Women's Merino Travel Dress. This dress is perfect for wearing in Japan in the summertime when it's hot and humid. It's made of a very thin merino wool blend fabric. I've never been too hot in it, no matter what the conditions. I really like wearing dresses in hot weather since the airflow helps keep me cool. In Japan, women tend to dress a bit on the conservative side, so this high neckline is good. It is okay to have shoulders exposed as long as you're not at a temple. The one drawback with this dress is the low cut on the armpits, so my bra shows. It works better when I wear a black bra under the black dress. This dress now comes in a variety of colors. Men's Merino t-shirt. In our last trip to Japan, I wore nothing but Merino wool and 100% unbound. And mostly what I wear are these unbound t-shirts. In fact, you've probably seen me wearing these in all of, well, in most of the videos. I really like the V-neck, which is great for all day and out, but it's also dressy enough to take with you if you're gonna go out to dinner or something in Japan. It also comes in a crew neck version. I also have a couple of crew necks that are great for all around too. And the durability has been amazing. I've been wearing most of my shirts now for four and a half years. I never ever thought that merino wool would last that long. This blue crew neck is a bit faded, but I've been wearing this for four and a half years. It's still super comfortable. The only issue that I have with it is this run right here. Maybe you can see this. This was caused by my son when he was about six months old or so, just holding him him and then kicking with his nails. Other than that, these shirts, I think, are in perfectly good condition. Again, the reason why this one is faded is because it was hung out in the sun too long. Don't do that. The t-shirts come in both crew and v-neck, and if you purchase a bundle, you can save a pretty good amount. Women's Merino Leggings. A pair of merino wool leggings is a must-have for my travel capsule wardrobe. I like to layer them under my dresses, especially for on travel days on the airplane, it can get really cold. I also like to layer them on any cooler days or if we'll be going somewhere air conditioned like a shopping mall or a movie theater. This pair by Unbound works well in hot tropical climates and I can also use it as a base layer under thicker pants in cold weather. If you wanna see all the details, I included my Unbound leggings in a comparison review of six different pairs of women's merino wool leggings. Men's crew neck, long sleeve shirt. Everyone should always pack at least one long sleeve shirt, even if you're traveling in the summertime, because you never know when the weather can change or let's say you decide to go hike Mount Fuji. And they're really good for sun protection as well. So on a hot summer day, if we know we're gonna be outside for a long time, I can pack this and put this on to protect my arms. And because it doesn't get as hot as say wearing cotton, it's okay even in the really hot days. Because one of the awesome things about wool is that it will help keep you cool in hot weather and warm when it's cold. This shirt helped me survive the Hokkaido winter. In fact, I wore this long sleeve shirt as a layer beneath my unbound hoodie. And because this thing is so soft and comfortable, I also wore it every night to bed in the wintertime. Why shop Unbound Merino? There are now lots of brands selling merino wool clothing. Here's some of the reasons why Unbound is one of our favorites. It used to be just George who wore Unbound, but Unbound Merino now offers plenty of options for women. George showed the men's t-shirts. For women, they also offer tank tops, short sleeve shirts, and long sleeve shirts as well. You could now put together an entire travel capsule wardrobe with unbound merino pieces. Tops, bottoms, dresses, lots of pieces to mix and match. Their clothes are high quality, so I never have any qualms about ordering from them. Even if they release a new item with no reviews yet, I still jump on it and pre-order it right away because I know it will be good quality. I really appreciate that Unbound styles are meant for travel and everyday wear, so I wear them all year round. 
Some wool brands out there are just geared towards outdoors and athletic apparel, so they're not quite the styles I like. Unbound, I can wear in so many different situations. Unbound makes it really easy to mix and match. They did a really good job of choosing a color palette so it doesn't matter which shirt or which pants you buy, everything goes together. So that's perfect for us guys. Does Unbound live up to the many claims made about Marina wool clothing? There's a lot of hype out there. Let's see what our experience has been. First off, wrinkles. When I'm packing our clothes, I kind of do everything. I fold them, roll them, and put them into packing cubes. When we get to our destination, I take them out. Yes, they are a bit wrinkly at first but I hang them up right away. The wrinkles come out a little bit from hanging, but mostly as soon as we start wearing a piece, the wrinkles seem to just fade right away. So I never bother to iron it. We've been fine just packing, unpacking, and wearing it. Helps you pack less and pack lighter. Yes, we have definitely found this to be true. Our family does check in suitcases, but that is certainly not because of our clothing. I can pack our family of five's clothes into two rolling carry-on sized suitcases. When we check a bag, that's for things like household items. The unbound pieces we have are super lightweight, like George's shirts, they roll up to almost nothing. Stink. They claim you can wear the same shirt for weeks on end without washing and it won't stink. This is the one claim we haven't found to be entirely true. Yes, our wool clothing smells much better than stinky synthetic polyester clothing, However, it still does retain some odor. For me personally, I have smelly sweat, so I tend to wash my dresses or shirts after every time I wear them. Occasionally, I will hang up a dress, let it air out, and wear it again the next day. I personally will wear my shirts three or four times before washing. Yes, there's a little bit of stink to them, so I just put them on a hanger and hang them up, and by the morning, most of the smell is gone. Not 100%, I mean, if you take it and you sniff it, yeah, you're gonna smell some, but it's good enough to go out and wear again for the next day. So that's really great when you're traveling. Washing and drying. One of the reasons that I absolutely love packing merino wool clothing for travel is that it's so easy to wash and dry. I normally machine wash on a cold, gentle cycle with a wool wash such as unicorn fiber wash, and then I either hang dry or lay flat to dry. And most places in Japan, it's set up so you can hang dry your clothes. I really love that the wool dries quickly, so normally by the next day, our clothing is dry and ready to wear again. Out of the various types of fabric we have in our wardrobes, our wool dries the fastest, better than cotton, and better than rayon. Also, when hang drying, the cotton sometimes doesn't dry quickly enough and it ends up with a moldy, kind of stinky smell to it that doesn't happen with our wool clothing. We know that when you're first considering trying merino wool clothing, the price can seem a bit high as it is a lot more expensive than cotton or synthetics. So we wanted to help you out. Unbound ships to most countries around the world, so wherever you're watching from, you can use our coupon code KENCHOQUEST to save 10% on your order. And we're giving away one e-gift card worth $250 to Unbound Merino. Thank you so much to Unbound for supplying this gift card. This giveaway is in no way sponsored or endorsed by YouTube. The giveaway is open to residents of the USA who are at least 18 years old. It will close on September 27th at 6.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. That's when we'll draw a random winner. To enter, please leave a comment on this video, one entry per person. In your comment, either let us know why you're curious to try Unbound Merino or what your favorite thing is about merino wool clothing. We will select one winner and we will reply to your comment. Make sure that reply is from at Kencho Quest. If you see at Kencho Quest, blah, 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 a bunch of other words, that may be a scammer trying to get you. So make sure the reply is just from our channel name. The winner will need to email us so we can get your email address and we will supply your email address to Unbound so they can send you your e-gift card. We will not ask for any other personal information. Thanks so much for watching. If you're preparing for a trip to Japan, please watch some of our other videos. We share so much on this channel about how to get around Japan with ease. Also, if you're interested particularly in merino wool clothing, I'm doing an entire series of reviews here on Kencho Quest. So subscribe for that as well.